Offshore, the combined fleet swung into battle stations and marched up and down the coast, softening the surviving German installations with a murderous barrage. Our losses were not as heavy as expected. While this was going on, other airborne troops in gliders and tow planes prepared to take off from Britain. One by one, the tow planes lifted the heavily laden gliders into the sky. Now the shock troops of the invasion swung down the nets to the landing craft. Bombers continued their assault on the beach. In a duel with a shore battery, at point-blank range of a mile, U.S. destroyer Corey was sunk. A moment later, the battery that had hit it was itself put out of action by a salvo from the destroyer Fitch. 